very good welcome in my classroom the excellence learner and today i am presenting a poem particularly for my cbc student at class 10 who are busy in, in preparation for the examination so the uh, title of the poem is and gregory for and gregory in fact and it was composed by w b its w b its you know w b its was a remarkable poet of english literature he was from ireland so he was an irish poet and he has he is the man of this poem he has composed this poem in fact and he has composed the entire poem for this beautiful lady that's name is ann right and gregory so before going to start the poem before going to start the explanation of poem line by line i request all you people just go ahead subscribe my channel and put your comment at the end of this video right so without losing the any moment i must start the poem this poem you you see has been composed in three different stanzas first stanza second and this is the last third it is believed that first stanza and the last stanza was narrated by william its his actual and full name was william butler its and the la, uh, and the middle uh, stanza of this poem was composed by this beautiful georgius lady that's name was and gregory correct so i first read out this poem for you people never shall a young man thrown into his despair by those great honey colored ramparts at your ear love you for yourself alone and not your hello hair from this very first stanza a vivid picture of a young beautiful pretty lady is being sketched out the poet praises her beauty in some different and typical way he says that his honey color hair has a rampart has proved rampart itself for all those shy lovers means the first of all you, i would like to give you the meaning of this word rampart rampart means the protective wall that was being constructed for the protection of a castle so the, in this line poet says that this beautiful girl that you are really a castle of beauty and your golden hair honey colored hair proves that you are really a beautiful one but this honey colored hair of yours proves a rampart for your lover they comes to you they attracts to you and ultimately due to this great wall of protection that is your uh, honey colored golden hair they find themselves in despair they are very much sad because these blonde hair this hair of golden color never allow them to disclose the feeling of love that they have in their internal heart right love you for yourself alone and not your aloe hair here the poet wants to say that he wishes that people should love you for your internal virtues and character morality and all positivity they should not be attracted towards you by the virtue of these outward material like hair figure and beauty 
right so he says love you for yourself alone he wants such a lover for her who could love him for his internal beauty not any external beauty and and earthly materials correct so the in the very first stanza the poet has praised this lady with some words but again he wants that he sh she should be loved by the virtue of his internal beauty not any external and outward affairs correct let's proceed the next stanza and we know this particular stanza was narrated and said by the young lady to the poet in the first stanza first poet praise her beauty then after puts his wishes that she must be loved due to his internal virtues only and with re in response to this first stanza let's see what this young lady says she says but i can get a hair dye and set such color their brown or black or carrot that young man in despair may love me for myself alone and not my alo hair the girls the lady says that she wish to be loved by his internal quality only she says if people attracts towards me due to my outward appearance due to my outward beauty i will turn myself into ugly and i will turn myself into ugly by dyeing and coloring my hairs and the color may be anyone brown or black or carrot you know carrot has some special color so she wish if it is true that people attracts towards me due to my external beauty external pretty i will turn myself into an ugly girl by denting and painting myself right so she has no any hesitation to dye her color in some different way so that he looks ugly by the and doing this thing she wants to test who comes towards her to judge her internal beauty internal quality right again but i can get hair hair dye and set such color there brown or black or carrot that young man in despair may love me for my alone and not my alo hair she wishes to be loved due to her internal quality internal virtue not due to external appearance external attraction in fact right and the last stanza again the poet says i hear an old religious man but is tonight declared that he had found a text to prove that only god my dear could love you for yourself alone and not your alo hair in the very first stanza the poet has put his wishes in response to his wishes in the very second stanza the lady the beautiful lady in fact has no hesitation to turn himself into ugly if it is possible right and in the last stanza here the poet has proved and advocated a platonic love right he says that he had heard through a religious man the religious man may be any saint any hermit or the person who has metaphysical knowledge right so i heard an old religious man when is to deny it who declared who has announced that he had found a book he has found a text 
the steps prove that only God can love to anyone without any outward care. Really, we are the son, ultimate son of the God Almighty, and God loves us without any outward fashion and any outward beauty. Actually, God loves us for our internal beauty, right? So, in this poem, poet William Eats has advocated very skillfully and masterly for the platonic love, where in, in this love, there is no room for any earthly attraction. People are attracted due to the internal quality, right? So this is the sum total meaning of this poem and Gregory, and I believe you people will go through this poem now without any problem. I am really very much thankful to all of you for watching my channels, watching my video. And now I request you just go ahead, like, share, subscribe and comment on the particular video. I will really await your comments. Okay. Till now. Bye-bye.